Welcome to ReneeEnergy.com on YouTube, the hub for all things renewable energy and sustainability. Our channel is dedicated to bringing you the latest innovations and insights in green energy, including cutting-edge developments like green hydrogen. Whether you're a sustainability veteran or just beginning your journey, we have something for everyone. Join us on this channel to explore inspiring projects for a sustainable tomorrow. We bring you the latest in renewable energy, sustainability, and cutting-edge technologies. And don't forget, for more in-depth information and resources, visit our website and subscribe to our newsletter for the latest updates and exclusive content. The hydrogen economy is a promising avenue toward achieving global energy transition goals. Hydrogen's potential as a clean energy carrier makes it a cornerstone for reducing carbon emissions in sectors like transportation, energy storage, and industry. While gaseous and liquid hydrogen are currently the dominant forms in use, solid hydrogen has been gaining attention as a potential game-changer. But does it truly have a place in the hydrogen economy? Let's explore this in detail. Solid hydrogen refers to hydrogen that has been cooled and pressurized into a crystalline solid state. Unlike gaseous hydrogen, which is typically stored under high pressure, or liquid hydrogen, which requires cryogenic storage, solid hydrogen exists in a much denser form offering potentially significant advantages in storage and transportation. To create solid hydrogen, the temperature must be lowered to about 14 Kelvin, minus 259.15 degrees Celsius or minus 434.47 degrees Fahrenheit. This process involves extreme cryogenics, requiring advanced technologies and substantial energy input. Despite these challenges, the high density and stability of solid hydrogen make it an intriguing candidate for certain applications. Solid hydrogen offers several compelling benefits. It boasts the highest energy density per unit volume compared to gaseous or liquid hydrogen. This makes it particularly appealing for applications where space and weight are critical factors, such as in aerospace or advanced energy systems. Unlike liquid hydrogen, which suffers from boil-off losses due to evaporation, solid hydrogen remains stable at ultra-low temperatures. This stability reduces the risk of energy loss during long-term storage. Additionally, solid hydrogen eliminates the need for high-pressure tanks, which are a safety concern with gaseous hydrogen. Its solid-state nature could make it less prone to leaks, thereby enhancing safety during storage and transportation. Moreover, solid hydrogen could enable new use cases, including compact fuel sources for advanced propulsion systems and next-generation hydrogen batteries. For example, the European Space Agency, ESA, is investigating solid hydrogens used in compact energy storage solutions for deep space missions, aiming to enhance mission duration and energy efficiency. Despite its advantages, solid hydrogen faces significant hurdles. Achieving and maintaining the temperatures required for solid hydrogen is technologically challenging and energy intensive. The infrastructure needed for such cryogenics is expensive and currently impractical for widespread use. The cost of solidifying hydrogen is significantly higher than compressing or liquefying it. Estimates suggest that the energy required for solidification could make this form economically unviable without breakthroughs in technology. Solid hydrogen is still largely in the experimental phase. Unlike gaseous and liquid hydrogen, which have established supply chains and infrastructure, solid hydrogen lacks commercial viability at scale. Transporting and handling solid hydrogen requires specialized equipment, further adding to the cost and complexity. For instance, a Japanese research initiative explored using solid hydrogen for off-grid energy systems in remote islands. While promising, the logistical hurdles highlighted the need for further technological development. While solid hydrogen is not yet a mainstream component of the hydrogen economy, it has demonstrated potential in niche applications. NASA and other space agencies are investigating solid hydrogen as a potential fuel for deep space missions. Its high energy density and stability make it an attractive option for spacecraft propulsion and energy storage. Solid hydrogen could serve as a compact energy source for remote or off-grid applications where traditional storage methods are impractical. The defense sector is exploring solid hydrogen for its potential to provide high energy, portable power solutions for advanced weaponry and unmanned systems. Solid hydrogen differs significantly from its gaseous and liquid counterparts. It has the highest density, making it ideal for applications requiring compact energy storage. However, solid hydrogen requires ultra-low temperatures, whereas liquid hydrogen is stored in cryogenic tanks, and gaseous hydrogen relies on high-pressure tanks. Solid hydrogen has lower energy efficiency due to the high energy input required for solidification. Its infrastructure is still in its infancy compared to the moderate readiness of liquid hydrogen and the well-established gaseous hydrogen systems. 
solid hydrogen is the most expensive option due to its production and storage complexities, followed by liquid hydrogen. Gaseous hydrogen remains the most cost-effective. Solid hydrogen is the focus of ongoing research aimed at overcoming its current limitations. Innovations include advanced cryogenic systems that aim to reduce the energy input required to solidify hydrogen, potentially making the process more cost-effective. Scientists are exploring hydrogen storage in solid compounds, such as metal hydrides, which offer some of the benefits of solid hydrogen without the need for extreme cryogenics. For example, a Canadian research team recently developed a metal hydride-based solid hydrogen storage system for residential applications, significantly reducing energy loss compared to traditional cryogenics. Advanced manufacturing techniques are being applied to create more efficient storage containers and handling systems for solid hydrogen. Efforts are underway to develop systems that recapture some of the energy lost during the solidification process. The economic viability of solid hydrogen depends on several factors. The energy required to solidify hydrogen is a significant cost driver. Advances in renewable energy and more efficient cryogenic technologies could help mitigate this challenge. Like other technologies, the cost of solid hydrogen could decrease with economies of scale as demand and production increase. Focusing on high value, niche applications, for example, space exploration, where the benefits of solid hydrogen outweigh its costs could accelerate its adoption. Investments in research and development, along with subsidies and incentives, could play a crucial role in advancing solid hydrogen technology. For example, the U.S. Department of Energy recently funded a pilot project exploring the feasibility of solid hydrogen for long-term energy storage in renewable energy systems. Solid hydrogen's role in the hydrogen economy will likely depend on technological breakthroughs and targeted use cases. While it is unlikely to replace gaseous or liquid hydrogen in the near term, it could carve out a niche in specialized fields where its high density and stability are critical. Potential developments include integrating surplus renewable energy to produce solid hydrogen, making the process more sustainable and cost-effective. Combining solid hydrogen with other forms of hydrogen storage could create versatile systems tailored to specific applications. As global demand for hydrogen grows, new markets could emerge where the unique properties of solid hydrogen provide a competitive edge. While solid hydrogen currently faces significant technical and economic challenges, it holds immense potential for specific applications. Its high energy density and stable storage capabilities make it an attractive option for sectors like aerospace, defense, and advanced energy systems. However, widespread adoption will require substantial advances in technology, cost reduction, and infrastructure development. As the hydrogen economy evolves, solid hydrogen may not be a direct competitor to gaseous or liquid hydrogen but rather a complementary solution for high-value, specialized applications. With continued research and innovation, it could become a vital component of a diversified hydrogen economy, contributing to the broader goal of global decarbonization. Thanks for tuning into the ReneEnergy.com YouTube channel. We trust you found this episode enlightening and motivating. There's a world of innovation and opportunity in sustainable energy, and we're delighted to share this journey with you. Stay in the loop with the latest on renewable energy and sustainability by visiting our website and subscribing to our newsletter. Your support is immensely appreciated, it's truly invaluable to us. Don't miss our next video on new trends in renewable energy. Follow us on social media for the latest updates. Enjoyed the video? Like, subscribe, and share for more green insights. Thanks for watching.